Award-winning spin Neapolitan pizza. They're known for exceptional food made from real fresh ingredients. Mm -hmm. But it's not just pizza. They've added pasta and a full bar to their newest location in Westo. Being the carb lover that I am, I had to take a tour of this mm. and get a taste of what makes spin pizza a fan favorite. Let's take a look. Take a look. I'm at the brand new award-winning Spin Neapolitan Pizza in West Omaha, and boy am I excited. We're gonna try some tasty treats today. I am joined by James Beard Award winner, Chef Michael Smith of Hi. Spin. How are you? Good, how are you? So this is super exciting. You're brand new. How long has Spin been open in West Omaha? Uh, well, we've been here about two or three months. Uh, Papillion, we've been open two years. We came to the market a couple of years ago, and uh, it's been exciting to have it as part of this community, so we're just getting started. Just getting started. It's doing well so far. Great atmosphere, by the way. It's I love fun, this place. Fun concept, yeah. What do people love about coming to Spin? Well, first of all, we're you know pizza driven, so we've got other things, pastas and some sandwiches and salads and things. But pizza driven, uh, the dough developed, you know, really beautiful. Hand, we hand toss all this, thus the Spin. Um, we roast all of our vegetables every morning in the in the stone oven. Um, that's how cooking started a thousand years ago on stone, you know, so uh, everything cooked fresh out of that oven and uh, they go on the pizzas and, you know, if you've got good salt and pepper, you're good. You got, yeah, that's all you need is good salt and pepper, you right? You just need to season. That's you have to you need, season the, the food. Seasoning. I gotta tell you, carbs are my favorite food group. I love pizza, I love pasta, and I, I especially know. love gelato and ice cream, <laughs> and we're doing all of that today. Now, yeah. we can't ignore the elephant in the room. We have Ethan back here, who's actually putting together, is it the pr primavera? primavera? We just dropped one in the oven, but yes. he's tossing pizza all the time back there. He's boom, 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 so. Well, I heard that I get to try this. I've never done it before, so let's go take a look, and hopefully I don't make too big of a mess. So now we're heading over to Ethan, assistant general manager here at Spin, and Ethan's working hard. He's going to teach me how exactly he does this. I've always wanted to do this. I'm so excited. So Ethan, tell us, what are you doing right now? You're getting the dough ready? Right, yep. So I'm just doing a little pre-spin out here for you. Okay. The flour is always your friend, because of course working with dough, it's incredibly sticky. So oh I'm already covered in flour with one. And it's nice because you just can use one hand to, of course, toss it up, one hand to control it there for you. Can you get a and little higher? And what I would like, you definitely. Do you have like fancy tricks you can do with this? Ooh, not yet. But I'm going to toss yet. it to you. Okay. Catch it. Oh, already? We're doing this already. Right. How do I catch it? Already. So you just always want to have your hands out so you give it a nice, um, <laughs> okay, just, a nice just little like playing field. Yeah, just to land that right on top of Both hands? Exactly. Both hands and don't punch it. This just is nice going to be interesting. Open Here we hand. go, ladies and gentlemen. Right? Okay, I'm ready. Here we go. Beautiful. <laughs> yes, I spun it. Now I have no idea what to do with it. That's perfect. I have no idea. Can I spin it back to you? Yeah, go ahead and try to spin Ready? it back to Ready? Here we go. <laughs> Not the best. Not the best. I'll work on it. I can't be a pro like this. Now, you specialize in Neapolitan pizza. Yes, ma'am. What makes a pizza Neapolitan style? So that Neapolitan style pizza is going to be more of that artisan style pizza. Fresh. Fresh, fresh. ingredients. Fresh. It's so important, especially these days. Definitely artisan. So you made the Primavera pizza, correct? Yes, ma'am. Should we go take a look at it and see how it's cooking? We should. Is it done? <laughs> oh, it actually, perfect timing. Perfect timing. I planned that. I planned that. <laughs> oh, that looks fantastic. What do we have on here? So the Primavera is going to be a fresh spinach, it's going to be a fresh roasted cremini mushroom, um, fresh roasted red peppers that we roast in the morning as well, and then a fresh cut red onion there for you with a fresh goat cheese and then that fresh mozzarella. Well, the mozzarella will be in our spin blend. The Primavera gets the fresh mozzarella that we actually cut up in-house. That looks perfect. Cooked Definitely. to perfection. Definitely. So you're going to cut that up, but we're also going to check out your wide variety of pasta today mm. as well, correct? Yes, ma'am. All right, chef, we are back with these completed pasta dishes, and I have to tell you, they, I'm just in awe they right look now. Pretty I yummy, love right? pasta so <laughs> much, and I could not pick between any of these, but tell us about them. You have six dishes here. Yes. Let's explain it. Let's start with this baby right here. Oh, we have pepper dill meatballs. Okay. Spaghetti meatballs. Spaghetti meatballs. Just a little spicy. Fettuccine Alfredo. Always Classic a favorite. Yep. Rigatoni with a spicy garlic sauce and prosciutto. Okay. Uh, a sort of a, a vegetarian rigatoni with red sauce. And then right here we have uh, fettuccine with chicken and pesto. And a little bit of arugula tossed in the last second. I can't pick, so I feel like maybe you should pick one for me. You're going to like the, the... That? This is what yes, I was looking for? Yes, I knew this it. I could tell your eyes were all over. We have a fork over. ready for me. I actually, I had to ask if I could try these because this looks too good. Oh, man. It's going to be a mess. Just abundance. Mm. Oh, you're digging in. 
That is so good. Very good. So this is our, our Sonoma salad. It's got some spinach and some mixed greens, fresh fruit, goat cheese. It's got uh, apples and raisins and then uh, fresh grapes. And then this is our um, uh, Greek salad. Artichokes tossed in, uh, fresh oregano, olives, tomatoes, feta cheese, scallions, etc. All right, and over here Cucumbers. you have sandwiches as well. Sandwiches and we soup. Have? We have our turkey uh, uh, panini right here, um, and then uh, a nice tomato soup. I think I'm going to dip this yes, in dip, there. Yes, dip, dip, dip. Yes, even better. Dip it in there. Get some of that soup. Here we go. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so while you're enjoying your pizza, your pasta, it's probably a good time to enjoy the full bar here at Spin. And I'm with Steve, and he's gonna tell us about some of the drinks they offer. So, tell us, what do you have in the bar? Full bar. Full bar, we have a lot of different options here. Mm -hmm. Obviously highlighting with kind of what Spin Pizza is known for is our local craft beer. So right here we have 10 local craft beers on tap, a lager to a porter to a, an Italian beer, Peroni. And to go along with that, we have a great wine selection. We have 20 different types of wine. And looking here at our signature cocktails, which are very delicious. Starting Tell off with a these. strawberry basil lemonade right here. Okay. That's going to be um, rum, lime juice, um, mm. fresh basil, muddled with the sweet and sour. I can smell that right now. It's it amazing. smells fantastic. Uh, in the center, what do we have here? The center is going to be our cherry pineapple Cosmo Martini. It's going to be a pineapple vodka with lime juice. Okay. Um, it's a delicious, uh, delicious patio drink. Right. Um, and then coming next here is going to be our ginger pear gimlet martini. Um, so if you love ginger, it's a fantastic drink. It, it's, it definitely goes well with the palate. Um, so a lot of different options here at Spin Pizza. They've got 12 different kinds of gelato, and I, of course, get to try one. And the one that really caught my eye was this blueberry butter cookie. I've never heard of anything like this before, but Steve is back, and he's going to scoop some up so I can give this a little try. Okay, so I'm always about the perfect bite, so I obviously have to get some of those Big bites in there, along with the blueberry. Mm -hmm. That is to die for. I highly recommend you try this. Blueberry butter cookie. Okay, which one's next? We gotta keep going, I gotta keep trying. Let's, let's try them, yep. <laughs> All of that was so good, Mike. It, it was looked amazing. Good. If yeah. you wanna check out Spin Pizza, it's on Wright Street. I think it's just off of 180th and Center, 402-991-7701 or spinpizza.com. I was in heaven. I mean, yeah. I they let me bring some of those pastas home and the salads mm -hmm. and the sandwiches and everything was amazing. Well, how do you go wrong? You got the you got the thin crust pizza, the Neapolitan style pizza. Yes. You got gelati, you got uh, you got the cocktails, yeah. you got the pastas. Yeah, you have everything in one spot and it yeah. was it was so good. I, I want to yeah. go back. It looked good. Yeah. yeah, thanks for bringing me some. We appreciate <laughs> I'm it. I'm sorry. Well, you uh, you're not at Nebraska Furniture